Welcome back to The Legend of Heroes, Trails in the Sky. Oh boy, we're back. We're back. Uh, in the last part, uh, we cleared out uh, the Zephyrol Tower. I don't know. The one for the water element. Um, and no. now we're running back to... Um, eh, fuck it. We'll go um, south, I guess. Oh shit, they've been using that same exclamation point the entire series, haven't they? Uh, more or less. Uh, Cloud is playing the Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel. I uh, am. Yeah. So, he's going to start figuring out all the the small things that tie everything together. And also why I started playing this game first for the channel instead of playing that game first. There's nothing over here. Anyway, this is just a small little side area at the moment. Um, there's nothing really uh, going on here. Um, but it's neat looking because uh, like, there's this waterfall that's happening. Mm -hmm. And, I'm, you know, since I was already nearby, I was like, might, might as well just come over and show off this area uh, before we go back to whatever story plot uh, wants to force us to do. I know it wasn't meant to do that, because obviously it's a waterfall, but it did look like it was going upwards. Hey, water can fall upwards if it feels like it. But, but yeah, because of the steam effect, it looks like it's running the opposite way. Yeah. Uh, you can buy, uh, and this is the real reason I came over here, you can buy a new uh, recipe. Delight. Well, not recipe. You can buy a new food stuff to get a recipe once you eat it. Oh, yeah. If you walk up here, you can see the like the outside section of the waterfall. Ooh. That looks lovely. I like this area. Yeah. It looks like there's a way for us to go forward. I wonder if Private Nix will let us through. Probably not. It's Dang it. Shot. All right, well, with that, uh, let's head back to Ruan. Oh, yeah. Uh, remember how the, uh, the, uh, orphanage burnt down? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we have to go deal with that. Yay! Story okay, I think my controller froze for a second there, which is why I stood there for a second. That froze? Yeah, it, like, stopped responding for a moment, oh. and then it... Uh, picked up again. It's a good thing we walk very fast on the overworld. I mean, you wouldn't get anywhere otherwise. Like, can you imagine, like, if this was... If you could actually, like... We're just following behind Estelle, and she's just running like she's a woman on a mission... I'm pretty sure I would have a heart attack. I was gonna They're say, it's just... like, it's like Estelle, can you please slow down? No, we can't! Increase it doesn't even speed. look like they're running, it just looks like they're power walking. Yeah. Yeah. Power walking incredibly quickly. Alright, so we've turned in, uh, oh wait. We've only done one quest. We have more quests to do. Oh boy. Fuck the orphanage. Fuck the kids. We have jobs. We have jobs. to go find the prototype. Okay. You have a job? Uh, I mean, not really. And we also have to, uh, to find the warehouse key. Hmm. 
Thank you. Okay. Ah. Uh, All right. They missed an opportunity. The client for one of those jobs was named Harg, but the difficulty was medium. It should have been hard. Well, it's Rip. not that hard of a quest. Yeah, but uh, you would expect Harg to give us a hard job. No. I say no to you. Portos. That doesn't sound like a person's name. Well, neither does Steve. Benoit. This is Harg. He yeah, sounds upset about it. We are bracers. That is our job, yes. Harg was wor working with barrels around the crane. Let's check it out. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Cooper. When? When is Stop Best here. Boy Olivier coming back? Not uh, eventually. Hmm. I mean, probably at the rate Cloud's playing Cold Steel, uh, he's more likely to see him. Sooner than you'll than get back are. to him. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, he, but he won't be here for a while. Oh. I'll be recording Kingdom Hearts 3 before we get to see Olivier again. No. <laughs> How long is this Let's Play? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> How long is well, this at, it, it, if, if you want a serious answer, uh, with what Landon has recorded so far, he said that he's probably about halfway there, so we're probably in for an 80 part let's play. Something I was like going to say, halfway to Olivier or halfway to finishing the, the LP? Halfway to finishing yes. the LP. Both. <laughs> Olivier doesn't show up till the last part of the game. Well, you said it. It turns out so. Olivier is the final boss. Now you we can't do, be disappointed. We do some fucked up shit and he has to put us down. Damn. Oh, so we're the, <laughs> we're the fucking... We're the villains? Possibly. Anyway, there's stairs right here. And then you can come down to this lower section and walk across this plank and then go over here. And then if you stand on this plank... Stand on the plank. Nope, stand on the plank. Stand... Yeah, <laughs> maybe. Stand, maybe. There, nope. Go no, back. Let, there, 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 you there, go. there we go. Cutscene. Let's fish. Oh, there's something in the water. I mean, I'm we sure could you can dive in. You'd just be all wet. Just be all wet. Well, anyway, the. The correct answer is, and if you noticed, I was walking around the uh, the bar here. Uh, there was a set of fishing poles, and if we talk to the uh, barkeep over here, he'll let us borrow a fishing rod. And now we can go fishing. Huzzah. I hope it's a big one. What do they what do they call it in Link's Awakening? It's a lugger? Yes. <laughs> oh she's so smug. Oh, boy, smug. Only the smuggest. That is probably the most smug she has ever been, considering she called herself the Magnificent Estelle. And she's been pretty smug this entire Let's Play. 
Yeah. And with that, we have the warehouse keys. Hell yeah. Yep, yep, yep. So then, yeah, just go back to Senior Harg. Nope, yep. There we go. And so that's the end of that quest. No bones about what? You really saved his skin. Fair. Huzzah, we, we did, did it. it. Alright, and then for the last quest, um, well, we technically already uh, picked it up. Uh... The, uh, the optional boss fight we had in the previous part against all the helm crabs. I did some off-screen grinding. We're at level 19 now. Uh, anyway. Uh, we, uh, we have the, for, they dropped the, uh, the zero shotgun that we need. That is, uh, the prototype for that last quest. So. Now we just have to go to, uh, not here. But I'm just going to do some quick, uh, a quick check over this stuff. See if there's anything. Yeah, uh, we have to go to the, uh, arms, uh, yeah, where the, the weapons are, uh, for, uh, the, the person who sells the weapons that, that's who actually we need to give the, uh, the prototype gun too. Does he also sell arms for Nintendo Switch? <laughs> yes. Good. Jonah Arms and Guards. And arms for Nintendo Switch. So this person. Carl. Person. Yeah, this person. Uh, yeah. he's the one who ha what needs the, uh, gun. We saw the bulletin board. This gun thingy? The Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky is currently 50% off on Steam. It's ten How bucks. much is that? Ten, ten bucks. Ooh. I should buy it. In fact, there's actually a massive sale on pretty much all of the Trails, uh, not Trails, Legend of Heroes games. Well, I think it's just oh, you... the Steam Winter Sale. Yeah. Yeah. All the all the Trails games should be on sale, both uh, Cold Steel and uh, Sky. Yep. So yeah. Buy the game. That's my pitch. <laughs> Buy the Spend game. Money. Buy the game. Give them money. Yeah. Maybe we'll see Crossbell if you do that. Please. Buy the game. I want to see the Crossbell games, damn it. Anyway, uh, we're going to turn in the last two of these jobs. And now that we've finished up all the side quests, it is time to move the main story along again. Like, comment, subscribe, and buy this game so that by the time Landon finishes Trails in the Sky the third, they'll have the Crossbell games, and we'll end up doing those before we even t touch Trails of Cold Steel. Uh, yeah, sure. That sounds good to me. Where are we going? Landon doesn't know. Landon's lost. Landon's lost. <laughs> <laughs> We're exploring. We're just walking across the bridge a couple times. Hey, that is a nice bridge. It is. it is. I'm glad we get to see it so much, honestly. Alright, out of town we go.
I was gonna say, Stella, are you drunk? Because you're moving slightly to the right and left a little bit. Uh, how do we get to the? She's fine now. How do we get to the no, gross kingdom from here? How do we? No. <laughs> <laughs> that that's my answer. No. <laughs> Come on, not you. I am enjoying the foliage. Oh, whoa! What the fuck was that? That was a. We we saw that in the previous part, I think. Yeah, we fought one of those before. Oh. It's a it's a giant beach crab. <laughs> crab. You no, know, there's like small little land sharks and beach crabs. It's fine. Oh, and a flying shrimp. Well, now I'm just hungry for soup. I want ramen. You're welcome. I want shrimp ramen. This game made me hungry for shrimp ramen. So anyway, the uh, orphanage burnt down. But we already knew that. It's time to play Batman Arkham again. You know, I know, I know that uh, portrait of Joshua is supposed to make him look like either sad or disappointed, but he just looks annoyed. Yeah, I mean, yeah. As you can see, it could have gone better. Could have gone better. Well, that's good. <clears throat> there, and now he just looks stoned. Those are, uh, I mean, those are his two moods: is stoned and <laughs> stoned and annoyed. Yeah, honestly, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> So are we just saying that Jack is Joshua now? Sure. Sure. We are yeah, the, come I on, mean, Estelle. You decided you're Machias from Cold Steel, so, yeah. Well, now that they've wished us luck, um, it's time to explore around. So there's hmm. a couple different areas where you can interact with, uh, get some information about what's what happened. Um, this is sort of set up kind of similar to when the mayor in uh, Roland uh, got robbed. If you can remember all the way back to friggin' part 10 or whatever Jesus. that was. That was, that was a long back. time ago. But I do think I remember that vaguely. When uh, Estelle was playing around with the the little septium piece, and everyone got mad at her when she was about to drop it, yeah, and we gave it to the mayor, and then it got robbed. Yep. Nope. I remember. By Josette. Now. Yep. Yeah. That was a that was a wonderful time. It was a simpler time when there were no burned down orphan orphanages. It's true. There's just a. Uh, Fairly, uh, you know, wrecked uh, mayor's office. So anyway, over in this corner over here is where the st fire started, and it looked like uh, they kicked in the door from the inside or something. And then make sure you talk to these two. And they'll give you a little bit more information, and then... Uh, we'll try to piece all the information together. All right, Phoenix, what do we know about the case? Outside? What do you mean, outside? Because he's not an airhead like you. Yeah, still. I mean, even the in-game graphics make it look fairly obvious where this all started from. Someone set the fire on purpose! <gasps> uh, 
No way. Obviously pick that. No now, way. Do you get any... The... Does, is there any penalty for answering wrong? Or does the uh, I think you, you get right bonus... Thing? I think you get bonus BP uh, for answering the correct... Uh, making the correct choices. Nice. Let me verify... Oh, hey. It's Chloe. What are you doing here, Chloe? Uh-oh. Someone pressed Chloe's Berserk button. Never press the Goku button. Let's see here. Ba, 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 ba. Um, yes, uh, there is. Uh, you get two extra BP for uh, answering that someone uh, set the set the fire on purpose. Cool. Yeah. Um, yeah. Nope, oh, Chloe's going to join the party again. Yay! Chloe is a support unit again. Huzzah! Boo! Oh, sorry. I was going to say, I don't, I don't think be... she's going to be a an actual party member ever. No. Wait, really? She does at one point, doesn't she? Cloud says no, so I guess not. No. Oh. And I mean, Cloud knows these things. I was guessing. I never said I, mean, I knew anything. He he started playing The Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel tonight, so he has to know everything. <laughs> oh, I have to know everything now? <laughs> You're an expert on the series, Cloud. Yeah. No! You you, you signed, know more you, than you, me. You, 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 you signed up for this when you signed the contract when you started playing Trails of Cold Steel. I signed a contract? Yeah. Yes. Didn't you know? Did you know? It was in the it's in the Steam terms and agreement. Oh, so yeah. that so that's where it was. Or, oh, yeah. Anyway, uh, there's like a very long cutscene, so we're gonna do that in the next part, part four. Yay.